If it's peace you desire, prepare for war. What's up, everybody? I am Silver Spies, and this is Gwent. In this video, I'm going to be playing a Fruits of Yizgiz deck. Uh, as always, you can find the full deck list in the video description, so check that out if you're interested. And if you check out my Play Gwent profile, you'll find all of the deck lists that I've been playing this season. So, I am actually playing in casual right now. Um, I just haven't had much of an urge to play, honestly, since I made Pro Rank. And I'm trying to kind of rekindle the passion for this game, rekindle my interest. What is truth if not an illusion? Alright, so he's probably playing a lot of assimilate. Assimilate soldiers. Um, I figured just what better way to do that than to throw together some goofy decks and play a few casual games and just see how it goes. And, uh, I feel I feel if you're looking for just a goofy deck to screw around with, you really can't do much uh, much better than Fruits of Yizgith. You know. It's a very straightforward deck, but at the Good same enough. time, it's fun to play. Hmm. So I've got a choice here of what to kill. I think I'm probably going to kill the Ducal Guard. Who doesn't like seeing those Thrive Engines keep on climbing? It's pretty sweet. You know, this deck, it used to be pretty competitive for like one season. And then, uh, you know, everybody complained about it, as, Next, as to do to. with all the good decks. And uh, it got nerfed into... <laughs> into a state where it's pretty much impossible to justify playing this unless you're just looking to screw around. But damn it, I still like the big slug. So we're just gonna continue climbing the Thrive ladder here. And uh, after I play the Necker Warrior, I'm gonna follow up with Forktail. Forktail is a card that I think might secretly be good right now. You know, Lambert is really good right now. Gimpy Gerwin is maybe secretly good right now. What you got there? Ah, okay. Uh, you know, as I was saying, there's a lot of around right now. There's caravan vanguards. There's Germain and his cows. There's, uh, I don't know, elven dead eyes. Just a whole lot of a whole lot of decks that just fill up the board with units. Which is why I think Forktail is maybe what is it you good. want? Or at least as secretly good as a monster's card could possibly be, which is probably not very good. <laughs> monsters kind of sucks right now. Monsters has been bad for like over a year at this point. Which I think is a point I touched on in, in the last Monsters video I uploaded, but I mean, how can you not keep saying it? It's it's so true. So let's see what this Forktail does for us. We're six points behind right now. I'm not going to do the math until I play the card. And now we're two points ahead. So that's not terrible. Right? 
one each for four. That's decent. That's something. And of course, if you want to talk about meat value. Then you want to talk about the crones. I am playing the crones. The classic trio out of the history pages of this game. They've been repeatedly buffed and buffed and buffed and they still suck. But uh, hey, it's, you know, the crones, man. They used to be the bomb finisher for this faction. Alright, well, we're Gurney, so... Let's push this dude as deep as we possibly can get away with. I've got Royal Decree. Maybe for Yagurn. That Naglfar has a bunch of targets right now. I think I'm going to Royal Decree for you, Gurn. Get a big boy in the graveyard. Try and maybe find Osrel as the second card on the Naglfar. That seems good. Hmm. Highly curious case. But first... Might even play the Striga next. Probably I will. Here comes the portal. Or assimilate synergy. So what would I rather kill? Probably the larva, right? One is just such a low thrive point, he can probably proc it with every single card that he has. Whereas he doesn't necessarily have six assimilate procs. My prescription. A bit of blood betting. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Alright. Let's get that Yagurn out there. Watch it die to attorney joust. Good times. Bruis? Bruis has new voice lines. Raise your hand if you knew that Bruis has new voice lines. And don't everybody raise your hands at once. This is damage crone? Okay. should play the Naglfar, get something It's something good on top of my deck. Play some carryover.
not sure if I'm going to be able to get the 2-0 here. He's got a lot of power on board. That is all I need. Ooh, I'm not sure if he wants that card. And I guess it could be worse. So this is probably the pass. I mean, I can play for 12 with this card and kill an engine. It seems all right. You can do 13 for sure. Ah, I think it's a play. Which means even Carol Taxi might be a play. Nothing more than a creaky door. Yeah, Geralt's definitely a player. Alright, my friend. Let's get this over with. Let's get this over with. What do you got? Oops. The revolution is inevitable. Merely a matter of time. <laughs> Did he even have a tactic this I round? I don't think he did. For the great sun! Well, that's fruits, baby. 2-0 every time. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. I'll see you next time with some more Gwent.